very good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I don't want to keep you out here too long. It looks like the weather could be upon us shortly. It wasn't that long ago the most exciting thing you'd see down in Carlisle Street, Balaclava, was a race between the little old ladies with their shopping trolleys and their purple rinses. Now, it's all the young, cool cafes, bars, fashion boutiques, absolutely everything. It's a real cafe society down in Carlisle Street, Balaclava now. As an auctioneer, it is a great feeling to see you know, a happy purchaser who's finally bought their weekends back and they've got their dream home. Then you walk inside and shake the vendor's hands and you know, they're happy as anything and you know, just faces with glee written all over it. And, you know, it's a really, really good feeling. I love my job. I guess one of my major points of difference is experience and I've done over 1100 auctions now uh, in the last 20 years at Hocking Stewart. Uh, so you'd think in that amount of time I know what I'm doing and I feel that I do and all my clients feel I do. So I guess experience and, um, and certainly my enthusiasm levels on the day. When selling a property by auction, you can have all the marketing in the world, you can have all the agents work involved, but the auctioneer really can be the cream on the cake. And in fact, if you've got a poor auctioneer, it'll be reflected in the result. But when your auctioneer is experienced, energetic, enthusiastic and well known in the area, that's when you can get the huge prices that you read about in the newspapers and online. Had a million and 20 now on the market selling unreserved sale. Had a million and 20, at 25. Had 25, 35 guys if you like. Had 25, it might finish it off. Good strong bit at 35 now. Had 40 now, straight back, can I say 50? Had a million and 50 I've got. Had 55, 60 if you like. Had a 55, I'm fairly big. This property's appreciating faster than your bidding, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, when the bidding's fierce, I'm like a cat on a hot tin roof. I am out there and searching for every single bid. You know, sometimes I've gone along to other agents' auctions and uh, the auctioneer turns up and, and I see it. He just doesn't know the buyers. He's relying purely on the salespeople. But when I uh, sell for my clients, I uh, open the property for inspection every Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday. I get to know the buyers. I know what they've got to spend, I've um, befriended them if you like, I make them at ease. So on auction day, it's a lot easier for me to deal with them and get those few extra bids that I really feel other auctioneers can't get because they've just turned up on the day and they don't know any of the buyers. 1,130,000 can I say. We're at 2030 straight back. One more for luck guys. 31 Sam, one last go. 31. 1,131,000 and we're selling on the market unreserved sale. I feel my style might be a little bit different to most auctioneers. I'm certainly not your drab, boring type. I like to involve the crowd more than other auctioneers do. Um, I'm not shy of a bit of humour too, whether it be good, bad or, or whatever. But um, you know, I really like to um, bring the crowd into my auctions, make it more of an event than just a boring old traditional auction. Looking good guys, $1,150,000. You were local on that push bike? Yeah. Good spot to live? Yeah. Terrific. See? That's worth a thousand. <laughs> I really feel my flamboyant auction style helps with the end price. There's no doubt about that. Even after doing four or five auctions on a Saturday, I treat my last auction as if it's my first. Is that a bid, man? Oh, I thought you said one more. You did. Was that a bid? No. Oh. Smoking Johnny's. My energy is up there for the whole day and I reckon that really shines through in the prices I tend to get for my vendors at their auctions. Oh, without a doubt, the best satisfaction I get is when I achieve a price at my auctions way over the owner's wildest dream price. And I'm winding into the going, going, gone stage and you know, I often feel like leaping up in the air and I often do and really slamming that contract down sold. At 1,155,000! Gotta sell it, it's going, going, and boom! Yeah, it's a really, really good feeling. I love the job.